On this Memorial Day, Tanya has the night off. Residents of Northern Kentucky honored fallen veterans in Williamstown during a service this afternoon. Nine News reporter Tony Maronis was there. He introduces us to a family that showed up because they could. The memorial service started here at Kentucky Veterans Cemetery North in Williamstown around 1 o'clock. But there were families showing up long before that to pay tribute. Standing at attention, grave markers wait for inspection by families like the Imordinos from Union, Kentucky. It's just something that I felt like I had to do because there are so many people today that are in the Army or have died from serving our country and they're not getting people to come and support them. Like Navy veteran Roy Andes. While he's buried with more than 400 other colleagues, he's pretty much all alone. No loved ones that either came to the service or they were the last in their family and they had, there was no one left. The cemetery displays flags of service members without family just in case someone shows up. Until then, there were families like the Imordinos who appreciate sacrifice. My dad's a, um, a Vietnam vet and, and I think it's important to show you respect. They gave it all so that we could have freedom. I'm completely all for going to the cemetery to give thanks to the people that have done this for us. Very important, I think, that, uh, to make sure that our children, that they understand what the full meaning of Memorial Day is. We are just paying our respects and hopefully teaching our children to do the same. The cemetery is open all year round, so you can come and pay tribute any time of the year. It doesn't have to be on a holiday. Tony Moronis, 9 News, Williamstown.